hello so the topic i want to cover today is uh, bch code the bch code stands for bos choudhury hogeman codes okay so here you can see that bch code are the subset of cyclic codes whose generator polynomials have roots carefully specified so as to give good error correcting capability and another important thing to remember is that each bch code bch code has t error correcting code in that it can detect and correct up to t random error per code word okay so it is very important time term t which we will be used uh, so many times when we will solve the problem of bch code so the property is another important factor which we have to remember to solve uh, the problems the first property are the block length so the block length of bch, BCH code is n equal to 2 to the power m minus 1 where m is a integer value and its value should be greater than equal to 3 okay so the number 2.2 2 is the number of masses bit is represented by k and k should be greater than equal to n minus mt okay so this is another important term which we have to remember when uh, we will solve the problem so here n is the uh, block length and m is that integer and t is that error correcting code in that uh, it can detect and correct up to t random error so th this is t the value of the t will be given in the question itself we'll see it later okay and property number three is the minimum distance of uh, distance will be uh, d min will be greater than equal to uh, 2t plus 1 so these are the three properties which we have to remember the another point is generator poly polynomial uh, so when we studied the cyclic code uh, we have get the concept of uh, generator polynomial if you have any problem then i will make a separate video on it okay so the generate uh, gener uh, generator pol pol polynomial is represented by gx and it is the lcm of m1x m2x up to 2m2tx okay so for example if uh, double error correcting code is there so the value of the t will be 2 as it is double error correcting if it is triple error correcting code then the value of t will be t and value of t will be 3 okay for in case of triple error correcting so uh, here in this case the t is 2 so generator polynomial will be lcm of m1x m2x m3x and m4x as as it is 2t so here 2 into 2 so 4 so generator polynomial will be up to m4x okay so this is the generator polynomial of a pch code for double error correcting code okay so another point is uh, degree of a bch code which is represented by smaller and uh, here you can see <coughs> it is uh, n minus k so uh, we have seen that the value of n is value of n is 2 to the power m minus 1 so we have written here 2 to the power m minus 1 we have taken the r this side and k this side k this side so it is positive so 2 to the power m minus 1 is the value of n and we have taken the r here so it will be minus r 
so n minus r is the value of k okay so if uh, the short note if you have asked to write down the short note of uh, bch code then uh, you can write up to this and you, and you can uh, add some examples also uh, let's see an example an example and this is very important example for your semester exam also this kind of uh, problem is given in your semester exam so uh, it is very important problem so uh, see it very carefully uh, i have seen this type of question in so many years um, in semester exam so the question is construct a triple error correcting code error correcting bch code with block length n equal to 13 over gf 2 to the power 5 so gf is uh, galois field we will discuss i have written here is uh, another whole topic we need to discuss uh, okay which we we can discuss later but uh, this time will be given in your paper though it is not included in your syllabus but it is important to know okay what is uh, galvius field okay so the question is construct a triple error correcting uh, bch code with block length of n equal to 31 over gf 2 to the power 5 so here we can identify that the value of t will be 3 as it is triple um, error correcting code so here t will be 3 so generator polynomial will be up to m 6x so it is it is written over here gx is generator polynomial and it is the lcm of m1 x m2 x m3 x m4 x m5 x and m6 x okay and the galois field is given here 2 to the power 5 so we can identify the value of with the galois field it is the application of galois field that we can identify the value of m1 x m2 x m3 x m3 x m4 x m5 x and m6 x this is the uh, this is the application of galois field okay so with this galois field we can identify that the value of m1 x will be x to the power 5 plus x square plus 1 value of m2 x will be m1 x which is this one okay so value of m uh, m3 x will be x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 plus x to the power 3 x square plus 1 and value of x4 x uh, m4 x will be m2 x this one that means m1 and the value of x5 x will be uh, x to the power 5 plus x to the power 4 plus x to the square plus x plus 1 and value of m6 x will be m3 x so this will be this will uh, find out by the galvez field and let takes the uh, take the uh, lcm of the generator polynomial and if we take the lcm uh, after knowing the value of uh, m1 to m6 x we know that uh, this is m1 so m2 will be m1 x so no need to take that so just putting the value of uh, m1 x m2 x m3 x from here we will get this and to find out the lcm we just multiply it okay so this is the lcm of m1 to m6 x after uh, after putting the value from the galois field and then we apply the polynomial arithmetic which we have also covered in uh, cyclic code if you have any kind of problem in uh, polynomial arithmetic then i will uh, show you later and another point is uh, we have apply, we have apply here the uh, oh that's it we have just applied the uh, polynomial arithmetic on the value of m1 to m5 which we have find, uh, find out from uh, this Galois field and we will get this equation okay and 
now so this is the generator polynomial and now <coughs> the length of information which is k will be equal to n minus mt and the value of n is given in the question that is 31 so we need to find out the value of m so n is 31 2 to the power m minus 1 this equation we have taken from here the property if you can remember the value of k will be equal to n minus mt and n equal to 2 to the power mt 2 to the power m minus 1 so this is how we, uh, we put the value of n and uh, you have to take the logarithm and then you find that the value of n will be 5 and after getting the value of m we will put the value here n is 31 m is 5 and t is 3 it is uh, given on the question so k will be equal to 16 okay so uh, k is 16 and uh, so it it is 31 which is given in the question comma 16 triple error correcting bch code okay so that's it so this is how we can solve this type of problem hmm? so sometimes you may be asked to find out the um, generator polynomial so you can find out this way and this is how you can find the triple rewriting bch code so this is what uh, i need to discuss and uh, in live session we have missed the live session so uh, this is what we uh, we, 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 we um, plan to discuss in live session so that's it and one other thing you just uh, write it in a um, copy and this will be your next uh, week assignment also okay and uh, with this I will add some um, uh, more question and I will discuss also that with the assignment one more question I will add with this because uh, the assignment will be in 25 marks so uh, this problem will be in 8 marks I have I have seen the um, semester question that this problem is given 8 marks so this is 8 mm, this will be a short note on BCH code this, this is 5 and I will, I will give uh, one and two one or two more question with that in addition so that we can cover up uh, 25 marks and this will be your next week assignment so just write it down in your copy thank you